year and a half on and off shooting. That's, uh, I would think, a pretty grueling, intense kind of shoot. Was it by it far was, the most uh, intense of the oh, water shoots? Oh, by such a long way. It was exhausting in the sense that we were doing back-to-back. -back. It was exhausting in the sense that, you know, it was the most demanding um, emotionally, physically, um, just in every way, in every way. So um, it was very intense. I was hanging in rags when we when we finished shooting, but uh, it's the best so far. So it was so worth it. Well, was it tough to keep your focus too? Because essentially, you know, in, in these last two ones that you shot, you really start to transition to into a new life. You know, you yeah. start school, you start to make your home in, in the United States for a few years. Was it hard to kind of maintain the focus, kind of moving back and forth, or is it having having your college stuff going on at the same time help you? It was really weird. Sometimes, I was trying to explain it to a friend, sometimes I just I feel schizophrenic, you know. I, I was kind of like, I would be filming in my breaks and then I would come straight back in into this college life and try and get my head into that. And sometimes it was really hard, but um, generally I find it very stabilizing that I have this kind of like constant, you know, whatever's going on with Potter, whether I'm on a break or whether I'm filming or whatever, I always have this constant thing in my life, which is which is my education. And it kind of like I find it very grounding and um, stabilizing.